how to add video background banner to Shopify homepage with autoplay. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, we're gonna be talking about Shopify and how you can use this incredible story builder to add a video background banner to your homepage with an autoplay feature, okay? And trust me, this autoplay feature is gonna help you tons and tons, okay? And it's a step-by-step -step tutorial, which will save you a lot of time and it will help you a lot as well. So in order to continue, obviously, you're going to want to make sure that you have a fully set up Shopify account. Okay. And uh, once you are into the dashboard, you're going to make sure to jump into the actual working of the store. So you're going to, first of all, go over to your sales channel over here. You're going to go into your online store. So in your online store, obviously, you can come over into your themes. And in your themes, you're going to get the different uh, options for templates, different options for themes and a whole lot more. So you can obviously add different templates, which they call themes, obviously. And uh, there's different templates like Dawn, which is obviously the default template that you have. Then there's templates like Refresh, Spotlight, Sense, Craft, Ride, and a whole lot more. So these are pretty good and fun free templates. Obviously, there's a lot of paid ones as well. but you know why go into a paid template where you can create one yourself so let me show you what the general idea of the store looks like so if we go and customize it takes us into the store editor where we can actually edit different things like the image banners the featured collections and a whole lot more so for me to get into the technicality of this stuff uh, i'm just going to go ahead and wait for it to load in real quick so once the you know, actual good stuff loads in. I'm just uh, going to wait here. And uh, here in your header section, you can click on add section. And we're just going to click on custom liquid. Now, what custom liquid is, it's a line of code that you can add for yourself. And this line of code is really essential for when it comes to actually uh, adding an autoplay feature for yourself. Okay, because without line of code, your autoplay will not work you know it's not physically possible to add an autoplay and then moving on we're also going to come to the template section and we're going to go down here and we're going to add a video now once you add video you're not going to keep video down here because it doesn't belong here we're going to take it up here okay and uh, you can either keep it with your header or you can keep it right above your image banner like this so this basically, you know, gives it an overall section and brings it into the front. So obviously, first of all, you're going to make the size of it large so it covers most of your screen, you know, because it's a proper video background banner, right? So we want to make it cover most of our screen. Now, once you have made it covering most of your screen, uh, you can also click on play video on loop, which will start looping the video. And uh, obviously, users will have to click on it to play the video. You know, and that is something we don't want. We want it to play on autoplay, right? So let's say we have this uh, random template of a video that Shopify has given us. Uh, so I'm just going to keep this here. Or you can just add any video that you want by yourself. That depends on you and the style of work you want to go with. But yeah, once you've added this, uh, what you're going to do is you're going to mess around with the styling. You know, whatever type of uh, editorial scheme you want for the video. Like, let's say I want to go with this. Make sure that uh, the view is large so it selects everything off of it. Now, once all of this is done and uh, once everything is as you want it to be, you can view the website, you know, just to get an idea of how it looks. So let's say I'm going to click on view. So if you click on view, uh, wait, obviously you do make sure that you save everything. Yeah. So once you save everything, uh we're just gonna wait for it to fully load up and fully optimize your store and once everything is optimized again just click on view and uh, you get an idea of what your store will have in common so as you can see this video needs to be played for it to be played but i don't want that i want it to play on auto i don't want users to actually come over and click to play it you know because that just doesn't make sense does it so once all of these necessary things are done uh what you're gonna do is remember i made you add the custom liquid thing so in the custom liquid thing you're gonna add a line of code okay 
And you're probably wondering, what do I mean by line of code? So in terms of line of code, basically, you're going to scroll down here where it says theme settings and it says custom CSS. So you can either add it in your custom styles over here or you can add it into your custom liquid over here. So this is your liquid code. So you can paste any type of uh, liquid code that you have. Like, let's say I have this liquid code over here, right? And uh, I'm just going to go ahead and keep it over here and look at that. So that is your liquid code that you can add and you can add any video for that liquid code for that corresponding liquid code, for example. And this video, as you can see, if I save these changes and I go and go my on view my new store, this video will potentially play on auto. So I'm just going to reload the store. And if a user comes down here, obviously right now the video is loading incorrectly, but once it gets loaded, if you add this line of code over here, this video will be on autoplay and it will loop. Okay. So currently, obviously it's loading into the store, but once it fully loads and trust me, it works like a charm. It works absolutely amazing. So yeah, that's what the code we're going to add in custom liquid. And obviously you're going to copy the URL that you have off of this video. Like, uh, you know, let's say this video has a certain URL. So I'm just going to go ahead and copy all of it. So there's this code. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead, copy. There we go. And once you go and copy, you're going to come to custom liquid and you see this HTTPS mark over here. Uh, you're just going to go ahead paste the video url over there once you paste the video url you're going to click on save and you're going to see that they're going to add the video url that you've added over here or for a better measure you can just upload this video to shopify's very own content section and that would be much better so yeah you get the general idea of how your liquid code and uh, you know actual coding helps you a lot when it comes to autoplay so i hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you and uh, if you need any more videos like this please do tell me i am always available and i will give you the easiest step-to-step -step guides for any type of videos that you demand and uh, if you have any queries regarding this video you can let me know down in the comments and uh, yeah i guess i'll see you next time before signing off please like and subscribe to the channel and uh, leave down a nice comment if you watch the video and please don't forget to share this video with uh, any of your friends in need or your family and uh, i hope you all have a great day so until next time i'll see you later and goodbye